What's up, everybody? Sparrow with a gun here from Sleepless Nights with another episode on Space Engineers. Um, I had every intention when I logged in today to work more on the Black Pearl project and uh, keep an eye out on my channel feed, Twitter, all that kind of stuff. I'm going to be posting a new schedule for next week because the past few weeks I've just been real harebrained with everything and flying by the seat of my pants but I worked out an actual schedule to encompass all of our current shows that we're doing um, so be on the lookout for that if you've been curious about how we're gonna be doing things and incorporating stuff but so when I logged in today I was gonna work on the black pearl but it had an update again which is awesome yay for updates can't never have too many updates for this game because this game just keeps getting better. So, biggest change, or one of the biggest changes, this has been updated to, um, there's a 64-bit version of the game now, which makes uh, performance run a lot better, smoother, faster, and indeed more powerful than it was before. Aha. Um, second thing, they've added the ability to change beacon names and these guys, which are motors, but we'll get to that in a second. Um, mm, 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 mm. Let's do that. Okay. So you place beacon down. Now, I don't know if the beacons actually have a terminal or not. Or it might be the reactor. Is this a reactor? Yeah. Okay, so you hit K. Gives you access to the thing. There's beacon, right? But now there's a name slot. So you can adjust and say... Beacon... Or, or um... Space station beacon something like that right and it renames it so that's pretty cool um, you could actually be a bit more precise now I guess because you know you could log where things are and not just what was that beacon for I don't remember what that was now on to the main event motors now motors sound very fun from what I've seen. Now, one of the test examples... Oh, you know what we could do with this? Oh, my, my mind today has just had a plethora of things going through it as soon as they posted that update. So let's say you want, like, a signal thingy, right? Like, so that ships coming into your space station would know it's here, right? Kind of like a lighthouse. Let's say we wanted that. We could do... Let's see, how would we do this? We'll put this. Not that that makes a difference. That's just one more block. But you put a motor down, right? And now I'm going to put a block on top of it. And we're going to put beacons. Now, oh, actually, they're not real bright. They're just more for signals. So let's use reflector lights. Maybe. Um, maybe. This is gonna blow your mind. Well, maybe not. Not if you've seen the update patch already. If you have not, prepare to have your mind blown. Alright, so then you go over to the reactor, or whatever is attached to the power system. Uh, which is not this, apparently. Alright, well. Um. I don't think we need a big reactor. Let's just grab a small one. Is that... Dang it. I need that angle. There we go. So this should work now. Why am I not seeing... Oh, 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 I know. The motor doesn't carry current. That's what it is. So these lights up here would need their own power unit. Keep that in mind. And you'll notice, if I can ever get to this thing, all that's here is the reactor and the lights. So, there's that. Okay. So the reflectors are now on. Now, in theory, you could have actually put the reactor where the one block was and then it would all be level. Um, I'm not worried about it right now, but just as an FYI. Now, we go over here. Motor. 
Now let's say we. this is your direction, left or right. If you want it to go left, if you want to go right, turn it on. And it spins! How cool is that? So... Let's see how this looks from a distance, actually. Oh, you know what? I just realized I didn't have... I didn't turn auto-saving off. Oh, well. Let's fly out a minute. No? Okay. So say you're flying back into port. Alright, what is this? What is this? Oh, that's cool. It gives the lighting effect, too. So you got this, like, beacon-looking thing. How neat is that? I'm hoping at some point, devs, if you're paying attention or listening, um, that we could get, like, colored reflectors so that you could have, like, a red zone, a blue zone, that kind of thing, and then, you know, you could have, like, just for an example, I mean, not saying that it's exact, but say you had some kind of vacuum system in place. That would be cool, too, by the way. Um, oh, there's the autosave. That if the game had, like, a <clears throat> pressurized hulls and stuff like that with the doors, once the doors get implemented, that you could have, um... I don't know why I'm bothering to park this thing. It's not like I'm gonna keep this world. I'm just here to show off the motors. Um... But I was thinking it'd be cool if you could have, like, uh... If there, if there were sealed doors and stuff, and then if a door opened and it, like, sucks things out like a vacuum, and then you could run over and, like, hit a button or something, and it would turn on something like this, and it's, like, red light, you know? It's like, bam, 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 bam. Alert, alert. Hull breach, you know? Something like that. That would be really cool. Um... So, of course, my natural progression was, that's cool and all, but what all could you use this for, right? And the devs, they were already on top of that. The, the tutorial video that I saw showing the updates of what all it did jumped right into that. And was like, you know, this is what it does. Um, so we're going to try this episode. Instead of going and... You know, doing a little update and then going over back to the Pearl or something. I'm going to try and just mess around with this mechanic a little bit. Um, and see what we can come up with. Because, you know, games like this, it's all about your imagination. And if you've got a big enough one, there's very little that you can't accomplish. Um... Okay, so that turns the motor on, but everything... So if I don't have any lights or anything, we shouldn't need any more power units, which is fine. Ooh, you know what? Ha! Ha! I know what I'm gonna do. <laughs> uh, oh! <gasps> we should make a biplane. That's what we should do. Give me a like or, or a comment if you would like to see a biplane let's build with working propellers. I think that would be awesome. Um, so let's go over this guy here. Because I'm going to make some right now, I think. I think that's what we're going to do. What's black? Black here. Okay, there we go. Like this. Motor. And this serves no purpose whatsoever, just to clarify. You know, this is not some kind of like, oh, well, with propellers it makes extra good time. No, it doesn't. Let's see. Can we do... Oh. What if we did a block here? Now can we do these? Yes, we can. Ooh, would the angle ones be bettered, I wonder? Bettered? That's a word, right? It should be. <laughs> Let's see what the angle, angle ones look like. Oops. Nope. 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 That's not... Nope. That's not what I wanted. Crap. 
All right, they're not they're not going to behave. So we're not going to use those. Oh. Well, maybe they will. If I did I need a block there though, so I can No, they won't do what I want. All right, we'll just start small and make regular ones. Was that five? I wonder if we have enough room. E. That's right, right? And this is one block out. Okay, cool. Beans. Does anyone remember beans from even Steven? What happened to that guy? It's funny, you see some people and they do really well, and then there's some people that you never hear from again. I probably have, but he's probably grown up now and I don't recognize him. It's just one of those characters. Okay, oh, I never put a motor here. The other thing that I was thinking of instantly when they showed this off is like you could make robots and stuff now. Kind of. Sort of. I mean, you know how it is. It's not... It's not going to be perfect or anything. But it would, you could still make like cool looking robots. It's... I think the biggest thing with the robot side is that you you couldn't leave them just spinning or it would look weird but you could use the motor um to effectively make like movable joints to where like i want this rotated out a little bit and so things wouldn't always have to be straight you could do them at an angle now all right now i just need to find one of these little reactor guys in here I think you're a reactor. Yes, you are. Come here. Motor, 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 motor. There you are. Um, we'll have them go right. I don't know how propellers usually spin, but whatever. It's not like they're actually real propellers. They don't really do anything. But they look cool. <laughs> Check that out! That's awesome! That is too cool. You can make a windmill. There's no wind out in space, but I mean, hey. You can make one now. Nothing's restricting you. You can make a windmill if you want to. Um, It's my windmill and I'll build if I want to. Build if I... I'm sorry. <laughs> um... Let's see, what else could we do? What else could we do? Cars! <gasps> you can make spinning wheels. Alright, we should totally do that. I'm gonna try and make a car real quick. I don't know how that's gonna work, but we're gonna try it. It does work on small ships as well, from what I understand. At least that's what I read. It was on the internet, so it must be true. <laughs> um, actually... You know what? We're not going to make a new one. We're going to build off of this guy. Because I don't feel like making the body and everything right now. So... Let us break this. And come out like... Um, here? Or maybe... Maybe we'll come off there. Yeah, that's fine. And then put... Alright, so... Oh, 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 can I... Oh, windows aren't available for small ships. Dang it! I was thinking that would make a good spoke. Um... Do I have anything else I can use? No. Okay, so now for... Oh, what? What's, ha what's happening? It's... Oh, I guess it's just powered on already. Where's the reactors on this sucker? 
There's one. I think. Oh, and of course I can't get to it. You guys suck. Alright, well we'll just put another one on the back here. And of course, we won't have the angle right. Wait a minute. Where's the... Where's the keypad thing? Oh! Oh, oh, oh. I'm a dumb. I'm a dumb dumb. It's a small ship, so it doesn't have them. The smaller reactors don't have those. They have the cockpits, which you can get to from inside. I'm smart. Uh, motor. Large thrust forward. Wait, it's set to off. Oops. I didn't mean to move around. If it's set to off, why is it spinning? Can I stop it? Stop spinning! Oh. Um, a gyro, I think is what they said. Stops that. Maybe? I don't know. Whatever. We'll build as we go. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna need... I can't do... Oh man, I can't do interior pillars. That would have been so cool. Um, I can't figure out why this guy's still spinning. I turned the motors off. Oh, that's inventory then. That's something I need. Why don't we just power everything down? Will that stop him? No. So he's just determined to keep on spinning. The motor who kept on chugging. Um, maybe if we... Why are you spinning? I know, I keep saying we'll just move on, but I'm not doing it. Um, let's make the... Oh, there it goes. Whatever. Auto save. Auto save, I hate you. Just thought you should know. Um, okay. How do we want to build a tire? Wait, why can't I place that there? Oops. Okay. Why won't it let me place that? Is it because of this thruster? I can't place that either. I can place on this. What? What is that? I can place on this, and I just can't. It's got to be these thrusters. Alright, let's remove them. Yep, it's the thrusters. Now, in hindsight, these probably should stay here, but I'm not planning on flying the ship once the tires are in place, so I'm not worried about it. Um, now, let's see... Black. And... How do we want to do this? Like this... No. Hmm. Don't want to do like. I'm trying not to make it too huge. Is the problem? I guess we'll do like that. Something like this, maybe. <laughs> oh boy. 
Um. Let's grab one of these. See if I can't replace these guys. What do they have? Two that way. This will look worse, but we're replacing them with tires, so nobody really cares. <gasps> what if we did this the centerpiece as a thruster? Huh. I mean, it would only work for um, one. It wouldn't be two thrusters, but you could still make it kind of work. Where's that block? There it is. Oh, I was going to try that. Um... Eh, we'll leave it. We want them to match. But still, you could do that. It's totally doable. Stop flying away. Still think they should go back to the old flying mechanics. Um, the other question is, do we want to make this a tri-wheel? I think we do. It'll match the landing gears. Okay. <laughs> uh. I bet you never thought you'd find a game about building spaceships and then find out you could still make tires for them. <laughs> Although, they're not exactly rubber, so it's probably not a real tire, but eh. You say tomato, I say tomato. Not really. I actually say tomato, but... Here's a question. Has anyone actually met someone who says tomato? Because I've never met anyone that says that. I mean, I'm not ragging on you if you did. I just, I'm just saying. I've never met anybody who says tomato. I'm going to sneeze. Excuse me. Sorry about that. Mm. Uh, I'm very professional here. Don't try this at home. Um, how many... Sp <sighs> I'm trying to say if I hate you. One, two, three blocks long. Stop spinning. Or flying away. One, two, three. Alright, we'll try it. We'll try it. I don't know if this is going to work or not. It might be too close. Oh, you punks. Is it this? No, it's these stupid thrusters. Er, Alright. Um, first of all. Paint you. Now, the light's not going to do much good up there, so we're going to put it up there. Again, this really isn't uber functional, but I don't care. Because I can't land with this thing once I put these the way they are. There we go. Um... So yeah, I can't really land with them, but it's, it's kind of one of those, like... This is mostly just for derping around, because I think it'd be funny. Not entirely, because I recommend modifying them in, in this way. I can't see. What am I looking at? Why is it ro- oh wait. Why is it rotated? That's not how it's supposed to go. right button I'm supposed to be pushing for this, but it got turned around in some weird way. I don't know how. Okay, these can go off. Wait, what? Now it's flipping the right way. What the heck? 
Flipping mechanics need to be explained. Oh, that's what happened. I set it to some other block and then it got confused. Alright. It's been explained. <laughs> Alright, so grab this. Power everything on. Not G. Uh, motors. I want all rotation. I wonder if they start rotating while I'm in the menu? Or if that's something that... Whoa! Why am I... Sp why am I actually spinning? Stop. What is going on? Ah! I'm... The ship itself is actually being rotated by these things. Turn off. Oh, I'm getting dizzy. Are you gonna... Are you gonna stop? Okay. Um, motors. Off. 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 Stop making me dizzy. Why aren't they turning off? <laughs> okay, well that's one way to do it. Turn them off, don't put any gyros on them, and then they'll just keep spinning. Yay! <laughs> They see me rolling, they hating. <laughs> Alright, are they stopping now? No, they're still just spinning away. I thought maybe the extra momentum of flying the ship would, uh, would turn it off, but I guess not. I mean, this would make it incredibly hard to actually fly. Because it's like the tires in your face. I wonder if we can actually drive it. <laughs> now I'm just getting ridiculous. I know. But it's fun, and I'm not going to keep this world, so I don't care. Oh, oops. Oops. Front tire gone. Front tire gone. Mayday. Mayday. <laughs> No way, dude! Oh, are you kidding me? I was joking! Oh, wait. Is it not? It is kind of working! <laughs> I lost another tire! I lost another tire! Mayday! <laughs> this is what happens when you drive drunk. Although I'm not drunk. But it's the same principle. Mayday! Mayday, Will Robinson! I lost a tire! <laughs> okay. On that fairly destructive note, I think we're going to end the episode. So I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, leave a like and I'll see you in the next one. Peace!